Ah, uh, who's that one? Uh, hello. How you doing, guys? How's life? Are you ready for a brand new Pokemon challenge? Squiffy, good morning, my man. How are you? Right, let's do this. There's no no banning around there. And you're not <laughs> not ready. <laughs> uh, or, or you're not existing. Which one is it? We will we ever know. Go on then, let's do this. Activate. Use a little bit of Spanky Mag. Nice <laughs> Thank you for the egg in this trying time. We've not even got to the trying time yet. Okay. Uh, screen transition in now. Uh, oh, there we are. And go! Let's have a, have a hit of nostalgia, everyone. I ran out of dance moves. That's it. That's all I want to know. That's every one. I don't have any more. Okay. Oh, I love them Pokemons too. Pika? Pika, piss off. We're not doing Pika. New game, please. Terrible block. Hello. Welcome in. Uh, what he says. Hello there. Welcome to the world of Pokemans. My name is Oak. People call me the Pokemon Prof. Not Professor, just Prof. Alright, Prof, how you doing? This world is inhabited by creatures called Pokemans. For some reason, Pokemans are pets. Others use them for fights. Myself, I study Pokemans as a profession. But I uh, can't get the name right. First, what is your name? Guys, What's her name? We've had Eggy. Let's have something else. I'll give you a moment to uh, have a quick think. Haru! Thank you for the follow. Hello. How are you doing? I appreciate that. Welcome in. What's her name, guys? Hieronymus Sondor. I don't know if that will fit. I could go with Sondor. Sondor will work. Yeah. Oh no, I, I need to spell it right. My couldn't. That's even better. Well, I don't think that'll fit. It won't fit. It'll have to be Sonder. I would totally call it Mike couldn't if I could. But it's one letter short. You're doing good? Hooray! Okay, Sondar it is. Right, so your name is Sondar. But what's a rival's name? This is my grandson. He's been your rival since you were a baby. Um, what's his name? I, I, I know all the names of all the Pokemans, but I can't remember my grandson's name because I'm a terrible, terrible, terrible grandfather. What's his name, guys? Who are we calling him? He's going to be the anti uh Khan man. And he uses Eevee. Mike Oxlong. <laughs> Hi, Ni Ho. Shall we just call him Ho? Yeah. Hiney Ho won't fit. Ho's with an E at the end, right? Yeah. Fine. That's right, I remember now. His name is Ho. For show. Sundar. Your own very Pokemon legend is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemons awaits. Let's go. Alright, first thing you do in any Pokemon game, as everyone knows, is uh, you withdraw the potion in your computer. I don't know how to manage to fit a potion in a computer, and how that works. I imagine it's got some kind of 3D printer, years before they were invented. It's the only way it makes sense. Meanwhile... Oak! Hey, wait! Don't go out! It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Oh, oh no. That was close. Wild Pokemon live in tall grass. Hey, I nearly got the name right there. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect sound. That, that's the sound of the Gungus Khan. Noot, noot. <laughs> Perfect timing. <laughs> it's dangerous to go alone. Noot, noot. Alright. Gungus Khan was caught. How exciting. 
That's gonna be hard. Well, phew. A Pokemans can appear any time in tall grass. They they like grass. Do our Pokemans? That's right. Fire types especially. They get high as hell. You need your own Pokemans for your protection. I know. What is this like the Mafia? We'll rent you this Pokemon for your protection. It's gonna cost you a grand a month, kid. Otherwise, something unfortunate might happen. Like Ho here. Grams, I'm fed up with waiting. Hmm, <laughs> Ho? Why are you here already? Any other organization other than the starter? No, just that. <laughs> Fireball! Oh, good news to those channel points there. I said for you to come by later. Ah, whatever. Just wait there. Look, Sundar. Do you see the ball on the table? It's called a Pokeball. It holds a Pokemon inside. They have it. I'll take it. I, I did think about it, Tobal Oh, look at those chips. Be patient, Ho. I'll give you one later. Oh. We should have called him, like, oh shit with an exclamation mark. Because uh, everything sounds really more dramatic then. It's like any time you're involved, everyone just goes, oh shit. <laughs> oh, we live in there. Ho, no way, Sonda. I want this Pokemans. Ho snatched a Pokemon. Ho, what are you doing? Ho, oh, Gramps, I want this one. I'm, I'm, I, I'm glad we called him Ho. But I, oh, all right then. All right then, that Pokemon is yours. I was going to give you one anyway. Sundar, come over here. Sundar, this is the Pokemon. Oh my god, I got his name right. I caught it earlier. You can have it. I caught it in the wild and it's not tame yet. Sundar is Eve Gangas Khan. Do you want to give a nickname to Gangas Khan? Yes. I have the per well, near perfect name. Gang. Ga. Kevin. Kevin's back. This time with more Ganga. Kevin. <laughs> Ganga. I was going to call it Gangas Kevin, but it's. Just doesn't quite fit. One character short. So Ganga Kevin it is. And boom. Kangaroo. Oh, it's Kangaroo. It's a very angry boy. Actually, there's no genders in this generation apart from the Nidorans. So girl, boy, gender neutral. It can be anything you want it to be. Who wants to fight? Snigger. Ho oh, sent out Eevee! <laughs> Go Kanga Kevin! Kanga Kevin. Rage is shite. Comet Punch is better. So here's the fun thing guys. Uh, we don't learn a new move until about level 40. <laughs> or level 46 I believe. So uh, it's going to be interesting. Good thing is uh, Comet Punch ain't that bad a move. But there's going to be an awful lot of it. Don't make a mistake of using Rage the Optional Rival Fight. He is a Ho, and he does want to fight. Sundar defeated Ho! Y'all got any Ho's of those TMs? Right. So the good thing is, uh, okay, we can learn quite a lot of TMs, and looking ahead, I think our final moveset will be Thunderbolt, Earthquake, uh, Fire Blast, and Surf. Although I'm tempted with a uh, blizzard as well. Definitely surf. We need HMs anyway. And he can learn it. And surf's just like flat out the best water type move. Hydro pump would be, but it's only got 5 PP. <laughs> and yes, uh, it can miss and that makes you fart. And see how, uh, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, there was also plot. See how it feels about you. Okay. Well, let's smash a gym leader's face in. And die immediately. The good thing is, grinding is not going to be anywhere near as bad as the last run, because we don't have a full team. We only have the one Pokemon we have to worry about. We're on the road to Vermilion City. Anyone else remember that song? Way. Oh, I can't wait to get Pokeballs and have no use for them, apart from catching HM Slays. That's going to be so exciting. Hello. See those ledges? It's a bit scary, but you can jump from them. You can get back to Pallet Town quicker that way. Yes, just yeet yourself off a ledge. And you too can get better quicker. Oh yes, guys, uh, Tiggy's setting up her own Twitch channel. She downloaded Streamlabs today. May all of the gods have mercy on your souls. <laughs> uh, 
Okay, Ganga Kevin's down. Not Ganga Kevin, the other one. We beat up a rat. Victory! Oh, we're gonna win. I've got a good feeling about this. I've got a very good feeling about Ganga Kevin. Huzzah! There we are. I'll follow you later. If I don't already. I'm a bit tied up with uh, Ganga Kevin. There we are. We'll make a fillet in no time. Do you have a mic and cam and everything sorted? Okay. Trainer tips! <laughs> don't don't stuck at my tips. The battle moves of Pokemon are limited by their power points of PP. To replenish your PP, go to the Pokemon Center. You there, young lady. Look at my PP. Make my PP better. Hurrah! Well, I hope you get all your every other bits and pieces working. I find for everything I get working, uh, it seems to break everything else. And then one by one, I'll just go through the checklist. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, right, I need to go to the mart, right? Hey, you came from Pallet Town. Jesus Christ, I can't even walk in the shop without being accosted by the staff. They're like those over-friendly ones. Like Walmart or something. They just come in and go, Hello, what do you want? Jesus Christ, I'm only browsing. Battle tit sounds like a perverted chief. Okay. Well, yes. But I won't lie. I quite... I'd happily watch a show called Battle Tits. Especially. Especially if we could get Patrick Moore from Games Master back from the dead in order to host it. Battle Tits with Patrick Moore. He plays the side of him, you know. Come on, beat up that Pidgey. Yes, such murders. Waters, Waters, <laughs> strong bat. <laughs> Anything like that to tanks that me? Yeah. Oh, it's, oh, we can have our own TV channel at this rate. We could have around the clock, twenty-four hour uh, battle tits. And if you're gonna say that, Squiff, you gotta say it properly. You can't just say Mortal Strongbat, that's, that's just wrong. You've got to say Mortal Strongbat! <laughs> yeah. Mortal Strongbat, get over here. <laughs> okay. This is my life. This is what I do. <laughs> Comic Punch more, please. You might get bored of Comic Punch after a while. I might turn off the animations to uh Cause it's just gonna be that little move every time. In fact, let's do that. It will speed up uh grinding as well. Uh option Ooh. Faster text please, because I can read battle off, yeah, that's fine. Ba -ba. <laughs> Sound mono, because it has to be, because it's a Game Boy game. It can't be anything else but mono. <laughs> well, Pidgey appeared. Go Ganga Kevin! Way. There we go. Oh, we're doing great. We're murdering everything left, right, and centre. Of course, this game is made when um. <laughs> Can we just take a moment to appreciate that sentence? Why do you know this? Why do you know this about your grandfather? And yet you seem to be okay with it. Uh Wild card indeed. Professor has the right wild card. Step into my laboratory. Wink. Ah, oh, it's me. Oh, I went to say spanking. It's not spanking, it's Sondor. Sounds like I have something for you. Yes. Ah, this is a custom Pokeball I ordered. Yes. <laughs> Pokeball. Not a sex aid at all. <laughs> oh, Gramps! My Pokemon has grown stronger! Check it out! Please don't whip out your pee-pee. Ah, oh, good timing. <laughs> Sundar, if you'll just uh, give us a minute. <laughs> I need to ask both of you to do something for me. No! No! I refuse! <laughs> no! I will not go on the desk! <laughs> no! <laughs> this, this stream is over! <laughs> On the desk there is my invention. 
Pokedex. Oh, that's okay then. <laughs> Kiss care, my love, and enjoy my box. <laughs> and yeah, it's a bunch of Pokebees on the stream. That's what I was thinking it was. What else could it possibly be? To make a complete guide on all the Pokemons in the world. That was my dream, but now I'm too old. So I found other hobbies. <laughs> so I want you two to fulfill my dream for me. No, not that one. Maybe the uh, the old dream, but not the one you currently have. Oh, all right, Cramps, leave it all to me. Sonda, I hate to say it, but I don't need you. I know. I'll borrow a town map from my sister. I'm the bottom bitch in this situation. I'll tell her not to lend you one, Sonda. Ha 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 ha. Such evilness. Right, bye. What dream is still on TV? Your dream lies outside. Very, very far away. <laughs> I was told I can't have a map. Grandpa asked you to run an errand? Here, this will help you. <laughs> Hooray! I know my way around, so that's pretty much pointless. Use the time map to find out where you are. Okily dokily do. Right, let's get to murdering! <laughs> so that's the introduction out of the way. Now time to grind! So we've got to go through to Vermilion uh, City. Miss! Oh no, is Comic Pop not 100% accurate? That might be a problem. Oh good. I just missed you and telling me how you Pokemon you got, yeah. So, I said you've got 100 and very, 151. That's very nice, kid, but I've got homecoming in like two minutes, so you best scoot. <laughs> bam, 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 bam. Alright, Pidgey. Ganga Kevin, kill. This has become less about the challenge and just the sort of story we're formulating about Ho's granddad. I don't know which one makes for a better tale, to be honest. I think you can run this joke into the ground. Which is exactly what Professor O wants to do to his hoe. Oh! I've not had a beer, can you believe? <laughs> right, here. To Viridian Forest! <laughs> oh, he totally could have the power to do that. Alright, ignore the houses. Ah, I've had my coffee now and I feel great. Sure you can go through. So, so sorry, I was rude to you. I didn't even talk to you. See you using a Pokedex. I'll show you how to catch Pokemon as an apology. No, I don't want to know. So. Little factoid, this old man here, in the Japanese version, he wasn't tired because he needed his coffee, he was just flat out drunk. And he couldn't get past him. Oh, he's lost his touch. And he ran out of Pokeballs too. I had to get someone to Pokemon. Actually, I do need Pokeballs. <laughs> makes us feel good. Just like busting. Busting makes us feel good. Just like Professor Oak busting a nut. Right, not the Pokemon. Pokey Mart. Okay. Uh, can I get Pokemon balls yet? Yes. Uh, just give me give me 99 of them. Oh, I can't do these left and right. I have to do it one at a time. It's bullshit. Uh, that'll do. Did you not? Oh, yeah, it's a true story. Japanese version is like drunk and uh, sake. Or something and you can't get by. And when they uh, did the uh, Western release, they made it so he needed coffee. Oh, I see a tree that needs cutting, and I can't do that. Oh man, the tunes! Hit you right in the soul. That's a sake shit. <laughs> Good one. Right, uh, comic punch to death, please. Actually, hang on, hang on, I'm rooting to in a moment. If I go back, can I fight the rival like immediately? I mean, we'll die, but won't it be funny? Or do I come back later? Let's find out. Gooey, rival.
Yeah, I'm not sure if it triggered later or straight away. Let's go for it straight away. See just how badly we go. Ooh, Spearow. Die. Hold on, Spearow can learn fly, right? Let's see what happens. If it survives Comet Punch, I'll catch it. He does not. Okay, never mind. It doesn't matter, really. Uh, is there secret items around here? No? No, fine. Oh yeah, let's fight him straight away! Ho! Oh, hey, Sunder! You're going to Pokemon League? Forget it! You probably don't have any badges. I don't have any badges. The guy won't let you through. By the way, did your Pokemon get any stronger? Ah, oh, ho beat down time. Alright, uh, you got two Pokemans. You got a Spearow, and it's level 9, so that's two levels higher than us already. So good. Heck. Oh, we got a critical hit. Fantastic. Yeah, I failed to see how he managed to beat the, uh, the Rock Gym with just a spit. Oh, I missed. Okay. How the fuck did he beat a rock gym? With just a spear and an Eevee? Oh, come on, and you hit twice? I'm dead. And he got a critical hit again. And I missed again! H how have I missed so many times? And he got two critical hits. I'm dead. Oh, I don't know. Maybe I can survive. Okay. Alright, speed Eevee. Five hits. Ah, oh, okay. Sand attack. It failed. Am I gonna win? One more. Okay, I beat the rival immediately. And I got up another level. This bodes well. Sondor defeated Ho. Ah, oh, you just locked out. Sondor got 280 beams for winning. I heard Pokemon League has many tough trainers. I have to figure out how to get past them. You should quit dawdling and get a mover. But I, I just beat you. Did it not register that I've beaten you? It doesn't seem to after time. Kevin crushes all hoes. Just like Professor Oak. I believe there's an item around here. Sondor found a potion. Way! Oh god, I wish I had a bike. I feel like I'm moving so slowly. So, so slowly. Alright, here, look, please. And now we'll go to Viridian Forest. Having gone up two levels, I shall destroy all of the Pokemans. And then I need to worry about getting a Pokemon that knows Flash. If I bump into Bellsprout, I'll catch a Bellsprout. For they can learn Cut and Flash. Which will be extremely useful. So just like Silver, I've got to uh, catch Pokemon just to learn the HM moves. There's no avoiding that. But at least Gangaskhan can learn Surf. Which is one of the uh, bigger ones I'll be using a lot. You can be HTMs. Again, to Viridian Forest, be careful, it's a natural maze. It's not that big of a maze, to be honest. Ah, oh, dungeon music, done right. right. Let's have a look around, see what we can find. Hello. Hi, do you have a Pikachu? No, I do not have a Pikachu. Why would I have a Pikachu? The Eater Round, level 6. Ganga Kevin, go! Uh, Comet Punch, I guess. I'm a little worried that Comet Punch is only 15 PP, so... That means I may have to make more frequent trips to the Poker Center than I'd like. Because I'm just going to run out of moves. Especially if they keep me missing. Okay, take that. Ah, I didn't do it. Um, poof. I mean, I can use Rage, but Rage is absolute garbage. It might one-shot these weaker ones, but I doubt it. Sonda found a Pokeballs! Yay! Pokeball! Got to shove things in them. 
Oh, Caterpie! Jiggly with Avrin, Clefairy can learn Flash. Okie dokie. Can... Bell Sprout not learn Flash? You can in Gen 2. Oh, bye Caterpie. Caterpie was our original, Kevin. No. Oh, I thought he could. Well, he can learn Cut, so... I mean, at least I'm assuming he can learn Cut. That would better. The thing is, I need Abra. Abra only appears after Mount Moon. I need it for Mount Moon. So, to get through Mount Moon, it's pitch black, so you need Flash. You're not going to fight me. Do you carry extras? No. Nothing there. Alright, let's, let's get to murdering. Hello. Hey, you have Pokemon. Come on, let's battle them. Oh, not Caterpie. No. What tactic are we going to use for Caterpie? How about Comic Punch? That's done as well so far. I might use Rage for shits and giggles. Oh, I could kill it in one go. Oh, yes, you are correct. Cheers, coach. <laughs> I knew it was one of them. Uh, it's Rock Tunnel. That's, uh... That's after... <laughs> Vermilion City? There's Viridian City and Vermilion City. Just to, uh... Complicate matters. Hello. You. You can't jam out if you're a Pokemon trainer. Why? Why can't I jam out? I like jamming out. What about jelly? Can I jelly out? It seems like a rather random thing to say. What, can we punch this halfway down already? Alright. Screw your Metapod. Caterpie. Okay, let's just rage, see what happens. Okay, it did that. Oh, I can't stop using rage. So rage is like rollout, but without the damage buff. It's just like the same flat damage every time. And I can't stop. Critical. Harden, screw your Harden. Yeah, it just keeps going and going and going. Does it ever stop? Nope. Rage is the, uh, just press this if you're too lazy to fight, but... Okay, fine. You ran out of Pokemans. Oh no. Well, never mind. Give us your money. Way! Got a potion. Awesome. I just went the long way around for no reason. Are you the last trainer? Have we got one more? I'm gonna be the best. You just can't beat me. The guy just gonna learn Splash and School Bash. Okay. <laughs> Splash probably not that helpful. School Bash could potentially be. Uh, yeah, Comic Punch. Oh, he missed. Oh, that's great. So, I will teach uh, Ganga Kevin Bubble Beam until we get Surf. I think that's going to be our best move for taking out any ghost sites that I happen to bump into. For now, at least. It's not like I'm teaching moves to anything else. So, it's not like it's a waste. Plus, I get it after the second gym, so it will be helpful for a little while. At low speed, yeah. Not that I'm really worried about that. I think if I'm grinding nothing but uh, Gangus Khan, speed's not going to be an issue. My only issue is... Really, it's going to be later. When I uh, come across trainers that have more than, like, you know, one Pokemon. Because <laughs> it's basically more of a war of attrition. I've just got to stay alive. 
Because I have no tactical advantage, really. Because I'm just a normal type. I'm just a normal type from a poor family. Well, I was fanning grass, so it's not like I came from a uh, good home or anything. I just use rage just to uh, save my peepee. -pee. I think there's one more train on the way out. Go away. Bruno will be owning me. Yeah. Oh no! Although saying that, I should learn Earthquake by then. So Earthquake should sweep it, apart from Aerodactyl. And using a heal move or status effect? Probably not, just raw damage. Just murder all the time, I believe, is the uh, best thing. I think I can learn double team, but... The thing is, because I've only got four moves, and it's a high possibility I will run out of PP. And I've got to get for the Elite Four. <laughs> well, five at the end of the game. I'm just going to need all of the murder moves. See? Daniel's card equals Khan from Star Trek. Yes. And also Genghis Khan. Which is also Khan from Star Trek. Oh, hi. Can I catch a break? I was gotten to a I thought that was a random battle for a second, <laughs> and it wasn't. <laughs> Sorry, I thought it was a trainer battle, and it wasn't. Body slam, earthquake. Yeah, yeah definitely uh, earthquake. Body slam's quite good, but I, I need the tight coverage. So we're going to get surf. So that's going to lock in one of the moves. So that leaves us with three. But yeah, I'm thinking thunderbolt. Because Thunderbolt can be very, very good. Thunderbolt is going to be pretty much necessary for uh, Lorelei. Plus, Thunderbolt is just like the best electric move in the game anyway. My only concern is uh, Genghis Khan's special ain't that great. He's uh, more of a physical attacker. You'll never get tight coverage four moves on a normal type. It's, we got to do as best as we can. Body slam can paralyze. Body slam might be an option. It's going to be body slam or earthquake, really. And then I'm, I'm, I'm juggling between either fire blast or blizzard. I'm leaning towards blizzard because that has a small possibility to freeze. Plus, it's uh, way more accurate than fire blast. But Fire Blast does all of the damage. So maybe we'll go with Body Slam instead of Earthquake. Um, what do you do? I don't remember this place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm getting easier to catch somebody I heard to asleep, but it's not a sure thing. Okay. I won't touch the low PP moves. Yeah. Then we should be okay by Endgame. Because we're not going to learn them until right at the end. And if it's the Elite Four, it should be alright because we should have more than enough ethers for between battles. Because it's only him I've got to worry about. I haven't got to teach him anything else. Anyway, uh, Surf's got fairly high PP. Yeah. I keep saying PP. Right. Let's see what we do against you. Because I ain't learning any more moves. Until level 40. And even then I'm not going to keep them. Okay, that's a good sign. We can get one more level. Sanshu, okay. Onyx is the scary one. How about Rock Slide? Hmm. I don't know how Rock Slide will do compared to Earthquake. Or how accurate it is. I think between Rock Slide and Body Slammer will be better with Body Slam. We'll cross this bridge when we come to it. Can I beat Brock? Let's find out. That's just a time for a place. As you said last time, an oak rings you, says it's no time to use that now. Alright, Brock. Oh, you're doing a different move. Oh no, you like that in the original one with no shirt on. And frankly, it's. Boy. Body slam, earthquake, what's that? No. 
No, it's gotta be Thunderbolt. Thunderbolt we need for Lorelei. Absolutely need Thunderbolt. Plus Thunderbolts, uh, it's... It's got fairly good PP, and it's accurate as well, it's like 100% accuracy. So, uh, yeah. Okay, Comet Punch there. Missed. Great. Oh, you don't do much damage there. But this is just gonna be... Oh, God. Shit damage! The fight! At least it hits several times. I can't lock into Rage, because if I select that, I can't do anything else. So at least it will do at least 2 to 5 damage, <laughs> if it's only doing 1 damage. I've seen other runs where they attack it, it only does 1 damage, but the move only hits once, so... Yeah. Yeah, I know it's not very effective. You're going to tell me it's not very effective every single time. Why don't you just tell me once after I've done it? Okay, well Geodude's down. Oh, come on. Way. Well, that's him then. Can I have a level? I can have a level. Oh, good. Well, if I lose, I'll just throw myself at him again. Right, you're the scary one. Comet Punch, go. Critical hit. Oh, dear. Ed Lapis, Slobo, Dudon, Jinx, and... Uh... The other one. <laughs> Can we win this? Yeah, I know it's not very effective. You, you keep insisting in telling me that. You know what? I forgot as well. <laughs> oh, it's used Bide. I have to hit you with this. You're going to use Bide, but I've got nothing I can do to not attack. Something's going to hit you. And if I use Rage, that's it. I'm, I can't do anything else. Is Bite going to kill me? It's doing very limited, very little damage. Oh. Now it's definitely going to kill me. I thought Onyx would have uh, used his Bite now. Eep. Is this going to kill me? Six damage? A? How's he only do six damage? I thought by dealt back double the amount of damage I did to you. What? I'm confused. Hit the enemy twice. Okay, well, I've only got rage now. Kill it. Kill it. We did it! Kevin! Repeated rock on the first try. Without any grinding. It's an official Pokemon League badge. This bears Pokemon become more powerful. The technique flash can now be used any time. I oh, know, just ask uh oh great. But thank you for the egg and trying to tie. TM34, taking to use the technique that can be taught to Pokemans. But it's only Bide. Bollocks, am I teaching it Bide? Bide sucks. But I didn't use Bide, and he did 6 damage back to me, and I hit it three times with Comet Punch. Well, so like, about 9 times. And it only did 6 damage back, so I'm very confused. Kevin wishes to feast on the rock turds foes. New album by Mulligan and O'Hare. Bing, 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 bing. At least it's a speedrun strats because uh, healing takes a six at the time because there's only one ball to go out. Well, onwards. Get through Mount Moon's going to be a bitch because. Uh, I have fuck all moves. Hey, I met you in Viridian Forest. You sure did. I just uh, had to uh, grind on trainers. There's no other TMs I can get this part of the game. 
Nothing useful, at least, anyway. Okay, go, Kevin, go! Murder! So we'll clear the route. Actually, there's a Pokemon Center right outside now. Could have Dig as well, that'd be great. Weirdo! Weirdo, of course, it's the pre evolution to not the bees! It's an awful lot of comic punches. Do you think Kanga Kevin's arms are getting tired now? Gotta be, right? I uh, have a rage. Oh, wait, did you have one more? Way! And another level in the bag. Bet you was Caterpie. Yeah, it's, I rage you. How does Gein Angry deal damage? Am I throwing cutlery at it or something? In pure rage? That's right, just so little damage. Way! See, I'm locked into rage, but if the Pokemon hit me while I'm doing it, my attack goes up. But I can do nothing else. It'd be better if rage only lasted like a couple of turns, like two to five, like Comic Punch. But nah. Youngster wants to fight. Does he know? Does he know that he can hire a hoe to do that for him? Oh, I missed. Curse you. I'm still impressed with the uh, Brock on the first try. When I seen just how little damage we're doing, I didn't think we'd do it. But then we got to remember that Brock's Pokemon also suck. <laughs> Fancy wonder if this game hates me too. Why, what have you done now? I don't believe it. No, no. Are you a trainer? Let's fight! Them's fighting words! <sighs> That's gonna. Bam, 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 bam. So, what's everyone up to today? When this is done and dusted, I'm gonna go watch the new episode of Loki. And of course, guys, if you missed it, I'm not streaming with Chaotic Clumsy this evening. For she is busy. And doing that thing they call work. Instead of Dizzy Punch, I learned Bubble. Okay. Well, Dizzy Punch ain't great either, if it makes you feel better. Way! I do have a decent fighting type moves, but the thing is, in Gen 1, there's not many great fighting moves at all. Hell, the one I'll probably get the best out of would be Seismic Toss. And only because it's got the word toss in it. Off to the tap room for all I can eat wings and watch Switzerland game. Oh, yes, yeah, so whatever you're saying. Uh, it's a shame about the football, but all you can eat wings down the pub sounds good to me. If I had a new Pokemon, I would have won. No, you wouldn't. I'd have comic punched that to. Oh, good, yeah. Wow, somebody heard me talking about Loki. <laughs> hey, Lazy Games, how's it going, man? How's it going, buddy? Thank you for the ghost and the pissing off thereof. Yep. Squiffy, there's nothing in this game you can't randomise. I thought about doing one just for shits and giggles, where you can randomise every single Pokemon location. So I can go into Route 1 and bump into like a level 100 Mewtwo immediately. And then cry. Wait. Going good? How's your day? Yeah, it's good, mate. It's good. Uh, hot as hell, once again. You got everything randomised. Nah. You looked at me, didn't you? Oh. God damn. Everyone's so bloodthirsty in the Pokemon universe. You look at someone. Kill. PG murder. Uh, I'll get one comic punch left. Oh, might as well use that and use, use rage, because I ain't got a choice. Well, it's Pidgey now. More Pidgeys? Screw you, Pidgey. She'll be angry all over your face. No sand attack. I'll piss off your sand attack. Sand attack can wreck me. 
Way another level in the bank. Woohoo, more minis. Well, I best get going to the Pokemon Center. Boom, 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 boom. Make me less, make me less shitty. The first 20 tests I use a modifier cheat just to get to the first Pokemon. I suppose it's not a cheat if you're using mods on the mods. Yo dog, I heard you like mods on your Pokemon games, so I modded your mods so you could cheat on the mods. Whee. Man, I wish I had a bike. It's so slow. So, I have to fight some Team Rocket in Mount Moon, so... I think my tactic for Mount Moon is to just run away from as many random battles as I can. Because I'm going to need my PP pee -pee, snigger to fight those. You can fight my new Pokemons! I don't want to. I'd at least like to walk to a Poke Center and not go all the way back to Planet. Yeah. Yeah, so I imagine it being a pain. More Comet Punches! Right, I'll have a quick look in the grass, because uh, I need to see if I can find either Jigglypuff or Clefairy to learn Flash, because I'm going to need it. Can't Paris learn Flash as well, then? I'm sure Paris can learn Flash. I know he can't even fire red. Paris is one of the best HM slaves in the first gen, because he can learn Cut as well. He can learn Cut, Dig and Flash. Yeah, I think he can. But then again, lazy. I thought uh, Bell Sprout can use Flash in Gen One. Apparently, he can't, but he can in Gen Two. You even learn Flash from Bell Sprout Tower to make things even more confusing. <sighs> also, in this game, there's what they call uh, there's no special split. So from Gen 2 onwards, they did this split between like your attack and your special attack. That's not a thing in this game. Your special is one. Uh, your special and your special defense is one and the same. So, yeah, sorry, special defense and special attack are like one and the same stat, rather than the split. Just getting to see Pokemon DB is saying that, but the internet isn't always right. No, I've definitely used it as spat before. Right. Let's get to the point where I can safely get to the Pokemon Center. Double check there's no more trainers. Yeah, being able to get rid of your HMs, yeah, that's great. And the uh, move deleter. Yeah, it sucks that I have to teach it an HM just to get past one roadblock and I'm stuck with it forever. It's a shame I have to use HM slaves, which means I've got to be really careful. Because if I go into a fight uh, with a HM slave, while I've still got me in my party, then if I fight back with them, I've lost the challenge. Alright, uh, Mount Moon to the entrance. Okay, let's uh, now let's have a quick look around here, because I know... Although I could find Clefairy in the cave. No, screw it. Let's just get for the cave. Alright. So... There are going to be multiple Team Rockets we bump into. So, I'm just going to run away from everything. Unless it's a Clefairy. Because I'm going to need my PP. No. No, no Geodude. I should be able to get away. Also, I don't want to spend 8 years fighting it. Yay. Right, what we got? TM12. What's TM12? I don't know what that does. Water gun? Yeah, why the hell not? There's no reason not to use it. I mean, I will replace it with Bubble Beam, but now I've got a, now I can fight back against Rock Tights for a bit. They get to the point I didn't need to use flashing games because I went. <laughs> oh, really? Pumpkin Top! Sponky Rumbles is here. How you doing, man? How's life? Oh, not Weedle. At least I've got another move that isn't Rage. 
bow. I just got 25 PP. How damaging is it though? Not very. Don't you dare poison me. It's painting away. Good man. Glad you're keeping busy. Yeah, good thanks mate. Good. Good, good, good. I think I finally worked out all the ins and outs of PC streaming. I still had an issue yesterday where I had to restart because my Sam was completely knackered again. Okay, stop stop with the defense. Yeah, I'm just gonna blow for my water guns all I can. And save Comet Punch for when I come against the rockets. Whee. Yeah, yeah, it is a bit. For the most part, it's fine, but occasionally when I boot up... <laughs> well done. <laughs> oh, piss off, Weedle. Yeah, occasionally when I boot up and go to stream, uh, I can hear my voice back through the headset. And I don't know why it does it. It. it... I found a way to like turn it off. I just have to like go in sound settings and turn the thing off and on again. Just toggle it. And that fixes it. But uh, I can't stream like that because one, you'll be able to hear the reverb, and secondly, it massively throws me off because I can just hear it. It's like talking when someone else is talking at you, because but the person talking at you is you, and it's incredibly, incredibly off-putting and just confuses you. I did one stream like that last week because I genuinely didn't know how to fix it. But it wasn't like the first stream, it was like episode 4 of the Crystal Run. And I just didn't know how to fix it. It took me an hour to work it out. And even then I don't understand why the way to fix it fixes it. But what the hell? Well, I'll go. You'll kill Sanchu, right? Yes. I think in yellow version they fix this ever so slightly. Because in red and blue, this is like where you get attacked by Zubats near then constantly. But I think they fixed this ever so slightly. We'll walk and one shot you. Because you're weak against that. I need to find out. I need to get an idea of how good my special will is. It is. Oh, good. Yeah, if that only did like half damage or something, I'd be in trouble. Oh, there's a thing there. Zubats can go to hell. Oh, man. I've always wanted to like Zubat. Because I do look genuinely like its design. And I've been forced to use some on, uh, on uh, Nuzlocke runs I've done. I've been forced to have a Zubat in my party. And no matter how much I seem to train them up, they, they just always seem shit. Because not only are they bad, their moves are also bad. I don't seem to be much way around it. But if you're in a Nuzlocke run, and that's all you got, then you are shite out of luck. Oh, get in the bin. Alright, uh, I'll get into one or two more fights, and then I've got to go back and get my PP back. Yeah. I lost! No! So I learned something in the confusing way, yeah. Six Zubats only run. Oh, God. I mean, I could. Well, speak of the devil. Oh, man, would that even be doable? Terrible book. If you want to. You, you can have first dibs on that idea if you want, mate. Bloody hell. Red and blue, especially, would be. Annoying as fuck to do it on. At least in like later gens, it can learn something like wing attack or something. Um, in this gen, it's gonna learn fuck all. Bite's not even a dark type move. Yeah, yeah I found an escape rope. Oh, there was a zoo battle near the escape rope. You might have to do some thinking, but I'm interested in it. You should do it, mate. I'll give you the keys to that run. Guys, if you want to see a Zubat only run. <laughs> Don't bother, man. Or you could just do it with one. 
get six. Just one. One Zubat. Wait. Hey. All right. Oh, let's go. So let's press on a bit further. I'd like a Paris, please. That's not a Paris. That's a Zubat. You know what? You're not worth fighting. You're just a waste of my PP. Pee -pee. I do not want to PP all over the Zubat. Oh, come on! Okay, maybe I made it up when they said they fixed it in this gen. For yellow. The music's not even going for a proper loop. Wow, it's way bigger in here than I thought. And apparently that means let's have a fight. Last wants to fight. She was just telling me how big it was in here. That wasn't much of a fighting move. Uh, Comet Punch again? Wee! Die, please. Bam, 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 bam. Okay, it's you down. Ah, uh, Bell Sprout. I want a Bell Sprout. Can I have a Bell Sprout? Wee! Plop. Bam, 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 bam. Uh, take a shot every time Spanky starts singing the theme tune. Because it's catchy as fuck. Which way is progress? Aha! Team Rocket! Don't mind me. I think this is the optional way, but screw it. No, Zubat, no! Go away! I'm gonna have to come through it again, because I'm just gonna run out of PP. TM1? What's TM1? It could say Mega Punch. Fuck it, why not? For now. Would evolution be allowed? No. No, that'll make it too easy. If we say Zubat, we mean Zubat. Oh, I got Mega Punch. So, um, for now. We're not going to keep Mega Punch, but it's another move. Damn it. Okay, maybe I'll get by with Mega Punch. This is going to be one of the longer areas I can get through without... At least if I get like a Paris, I can use Dig or something. There we are. This is only going to be in the short term. So we'll replace Water Gun with Bubble Beam. Then in turn, replace Bubble Beam with Surf. Once we get to uh, Vermilion City, we'll replace... Maybe Mega Punch with Thunderbolt. Oh, you dick. I'm still unsure about the last two moves. I'm thinking Body Slam because he does have high attack stat rather than a, quite a low special. So Body Slam will do a lot of damage. Fuck your workings. Okay, Mega Punch is doing this good. Maybe I won't have to uh, disappear it. So, you are good. Yes, I am. Sondor found Aether. Yay! Oh, God. And because I'm allowing uh, the use of HM slays in here, I can also learn Fly later. So at least I can get around. That was a ball aching a uh, silver, not being able to get around. Sorry, Crystal. Crystal, sorry. Not being able to fly was a pain. Way! Hey! Level 19, we're on a roll. I'm only an hour in. Caterpie only no even illusion around. Oh, somebody's done that. Caterpie only learns tackle and string shot, nothing else. I don't think you can teach it any TMs. I think that's all you've got. It's got to be Gen 1 or Gen 2. Uh, Gem 1 you will have a harder time just because it'll be so much more limited, I'd imagine. Yeah, punch that back. Way! Now guys, if you ever got a bat problem, just punch it. Did you come to explore too? Yes. Oh no, are you a rock trainer? Oh no, you're a 
I think there's a mandatory rock fighter trainer in here I have to fight. And he can be quite difficult. But then again, I've just remembered I've got water guns, so never mind. I've got, I've got water gun. <laughs> never mind. Screw your rata. Poof. You know, I don't even know what base damage uh, Mega Pooch is compared to Comet Punch. Because the game doesn't tell you. The game doesn't tell you what moves do what. There's no descriptors and, and no power levels. Zubat does have a lot of weaknesses. He takes all of the damage and doesn't do any back. You might have to uh, rely just on... Oh god, no. Am I going to die? No! I can't die to Zubat. I die to Zubat. It's... Mega Punch is higher. Yeah, I thought it might be. But I I don't know. The game genuine does not tell you. If I go to Pokemon, they tell me stats. Tell you moves. Tell you moves. Yeah, that's it. That's all it tells you. Uh I'm gonna die. I'm going to die. Escape rope, please. I don't want to do that so soon, but my health is very, very low. And I want my PP back. Bloody confusion. Kite Punch is basically like double slap kind of weak. Yeah. It's the only move I start off with. I say, uh, Genghis Khan doesn't actually learn any moves till like level 46, naturally. So, I've only got it for now. Because I have nothing else. I'll do yellow, so when I get a starter Pokemon, but instead of a starter Pokemon, I'll get another Zoba. Yeah, do that. You'll also want to make things hardy for yourself. So, the either your opponent gets, uh, I believe it's... If you win both fights, he has a Jolteon. If you win one, lose one, he has a Flareon. And if you lose both, he has a Vaporeon. So... I think Jolteon will be the hardest for you to do. I want to say first two rival fights, I mean like the first actual fight of the game. And then that one on the, uh, is it Route 2? Or Route 24, whatever it is. The optional one, right, is on the left of uh, Viridian City. Yes, if you beat both of them, you'll have Jolteon to contend with, and I imagine that will make life so much harder for you. Oh, dear. Zubat, please go away. I'm preserving my peepee. -pee. Leave my peepee -pee alone. Do not bite my peepee. -pee. No, no, that's true. Because it's like the game's way of making it easy on you. Because you're meant to have Pikachu, and uh, he's strong against Vaporeon. The game thinks, ah, oh, you're a bit crap, aren't you? You just lost the two trainer fights. You, uh, you should probably uh, make things a bit easier on you. Why do you still have Pikachu in your party, though? I don't know. Can you put Pikachu in your box? In yellow? And the only times I've play replayed it is to modify it. So I'm not sure. I can't remember. Are you stuck with him? He's like the gimmick of the game. You're meant to be able to talk to him. He follows you around. But you can just say, get in the box. Stay there forever and ever and ever. Use Pikachu once. And that's a Cataratata or a Pidgey. And then he can get in the get in the box never to come out. Oh, no, I wanted that. Give me that, whatever it is. Moonstone? That's useless to me. Free money! Nice. Oh, go away. It's pretty ballsy of Pokemon to uh, start off its franchises with the first dungeon being one of the longest in the entire damn game. 
if not the series. That room's pretty damn big. Think of all the dungeons you go through in Johto, for example. None of them are big. They're only like a couple of rooms each. I think Ice Skate is probably the longest one, and even that's not too long. Once you've done the puzzles, you can quickly get through it. Take that. Good, good. Ah, oh, Kevin, well done. Going up a level for squirting all over Geo, dude. Good for you. Little kids should leave grown ups alone. I agree. Now tell Jimmy that. See, Rocket's not all that bad. Okay, can guess. Uh, Mega punch it in the face. Or miss. Miss is fine. Mega punch it again. Thank you. Whee. Goodbye. Alright, uh, and a Zubat. More Zubats. Why the give Team Rocket all the Zubats? So, other fun challenges I've seen. Uh, this one's where people have done, like, oh, can I beat the game using, like, Team Rocket's team? So, just you know, using Ekin's Coffin and Meowth. The games have. That's like Dungeons and Puzzle Elements in there. Yeah. Yeah, the scenes are taking a, uh, a back step, the mod I've got on. I mean, yeah, uh, Sword and Shield have got like the massive wild area. But you can't just ignore it all. The actual dungeons themselves don't really exist. And even if they do, there's normally like trainers on there that will heal your Pokemons. Uh, I'm trying to think what actual kind of dungeons there are. There's a few caves you go through, but even then I like singular screens. And because there's no random battles, you can just ignore everything and just bimble on through. Not doable here. To stop every two seconds to fight a Zubat. Uh, I said I was going to stop fighting random battles because I'll run out of PP. But I'm getting through it. Oh god. Please stop. I've not found a Clefairy yet, guys. I know what to do if I find a Clefairy. Hey, stop. I found these fossils. They're both mine. Alright, calm down. Seems to put you off someone to help get through the cave and they heal you after every battle. Yeah, they do. They do. I know there's one route on Sword and Shield. You, you go through a cave, which ain't massively long. But there's like a girl at the entrance of the cave and a girl at the exit to heal you up. Oh, do I f I get to fight Team Rocket after this, don't I? Like the proper Team Rocket. Ooh. Ah, Voltorb. Uh, Mega Punch again. Is Mega Punch just going to be a dang good move all the way? Maybe I could just stick with Mega Punch. Oh, if only it was more accurate. It's only like 70% accurate or something. I seem to miss a lot. Pretty close to learning Bite. Are you sure about that? When I checked, it said it, I don't learn a move until like level 26. I don't think Bite was in Gen 2. There's a dark type move. I may be wrong. Yeah, we'll take the Helix Fossil. Insert challenge room memes here. Is that my room? I'll take the Helix Fossil. Don't I don't care. I don't think I've learned any moves to like level 46. Because normally, to catch Genghis Khan, they're in the survival zone and they're, they're already like level 30 or so. Stop right there! Oh, guys, we're gonna do it. You're gonna sing along. That fossil is Team Rockets. Surrender now, or prepare. Hey, you missed off the song. Fine. Okay, we won't bother then. 
Rocket wants to fight. No, it's Team Rocket. It's Jesse and James. Get it right, King. Oh, Kanga Kevin. Pretend it's the anime now. Okay, punch it. Kevin, just punch everything. This is the opposite of Kevin. So Kevin just uses uh, Psybeam all the time, just confuses everything. Kevin ain't got time for that. Kevin just wants to punch everything in the face. Brawn over brains. Well, this is going surprisingly well. That's fun. I don't think this one is going to take as long as the other one. A brat beat us. Yes. Team Rocket, bless up at the speed of light. There we are. It's a shit James impression out of the way. Please get out of this cave. Thank God. Now, this is where it's a bit of bad game design. There's a ledge down here, and if you jump back, you can't go back. Aha! I knew there was a great war in here somewhere. Yeah, you genuinely cannot go back if you get past it. So, we've committed now. It's a bit crap. What's you? TM4? What's TM4? I don't know what TM4 is. TM contain whirlwind? No. Whirlwind sucks. No turning back now. Well, I'm level 21, so shall we just go for Misty straight away? I think we should. Yeah, let's kill Misty. Played out with Ruby and Sapphire. Yeah, they're good games. I say, when I got Ruby and Sapphire... Oh. That's the wrong box. When I got Ruby and Sapphire, I was on a holiday. And... I wasn't feeling too well. And when I got it... Uh, the game... Hadn't even properly come out yet. So we got it like, a few days early. Uh, let's jump all this shit. That was a good holiday. I just stayed in the caravan feeling a bit ill. Uh, playing Ruby and Sapphire. Can't complain. Okay. Good. A couple of Ks. Um, don't think it's... I think near the end of the game, there's a couple, but... But, I say, for Mount Moon, for like, the very first dungeon in the entire franchise, it's pretty damn long. Right, let's speed up Misty. Hang on. Look how long this gym is, right? Nowhere near as big. But you just go massively backwards. It's the wrong shape. It should be that shape, not that shape. Unless we went through a turnstile on the door. Got turned around. And then one in Devon Town wasn't long, it was really short. Yeah. Like, the ones you do have to pass through, um, you are relatively short. I think they they can be quite big, but it's only if you come back later, when you've got the HMs and start to explore, they open up. But for the critical path, you can just blaze through. Oh, I missed. Punch. Punch it, Chewie. Okay, well, I didn't take out shoulder, but that's okay. Because Missy doesn't have a shoulder. She's got a star you and a star me. My one concern is they are quite fast. Yeah, and for the most part, um, so if you know where you're going, it's pretty quick. And for the most part, you don't have the HMs anyway, so you can't explore. So you're pretty much on rails. I played it not so long back doing a Ender's Lock run. I don't recall having much issue going through any caves or dungeons or anything. I think the uh, the Team Magma base is pretty big. Not complicated though, just big. But it wasn't anywhere near as bad as like, the random battles. 
All right. Okay, let's get really cocky. Let's let's take on the Misty without even healing up. And then regret it. All right, what is your approach? My policy is an all-out offensive with water-type Pokemon. Misty, the world-famous beauty, is your host. Are you ready, sweetie? Misty's... How old's Misty in the new anime? Like 14? I don't want her to call me sweetie. Teleport powers were annoying the first time you did Yeah, they've been a staple of the series. Okay, we do that in Sylphco and the Rocket Hideout. Uh, it's got to be Mega Punch, doesn't it? Well, a Stormy, you down? Stormy is going to be a bit more tanky. Maybe I might have to hit it twice. I'll use Harden. Don't use Harden. No, that affects me. Ooh. Use X Defend. Okay. Defense and Defense up. You could have just used Harden again. It doesn't matter because I got a critical hit, so screw you. Guys, it's a second gym best gen. <laughs> First attempt. Okie dokie then. Can't believe I lost. You can have the Cascade Badge to show that you beat me. Thank you. Cascade Badge makes all Pokemon to level 30 a day. That includes even outsiders. Strangers? This is a local gym for local people. We've got nothing for you here. TM teaches Bubble Beam. Use it on aquatic Pokemon. How about I ignore your advice and use it in a lot of aquatic Pokemon? In Bubble Beam. Teach Bubble Beam, yes. Let me try to learn Bubble Beam. Dragon Con can't learn more than four moves. Do you need an older move to make room for Bubble Beam? Yes. Bye, Water Gun. It was fun to use it for one dungeon. That. Well, it's, uh, it's not been much of a challenge so far, I must say. We haven't really come across any fighting sites, though. Fighting sites are scary because we're weak against those. But then again, if I get something like Earthquake, then we'll be fine. Thank you, your Pokemon are fighting fit. Hope to see you either again. I hope to never come back here. Hello. I took care of injured Pokemon. I nursed this Bulbasaur back to health. He needs a good trainer to take care of it now. That's it. Yeah. See ya. Yeah. Yeah. Leave me alone. Far before. See ya. Right. Well, I'm gonna need someone that can learn Flash soon. And cut. Oh, shut up. I don't care. We don't care for what you have to say, sir. I know you've got a rare candy back here somewhere. Where is it? There it is! Thank you. So by endgame, I don't really want to grind. So I shall save these rare candies to right near the end. And then we shall spam a load. Oh yeah, rival fight. I forgot about rival fight. Can we beat you three times in one stream? Let's see what we caught. I've caught nothing yet. I haven't caught anything. In fact, the one I'm using, Professor Oak, caught. Oh, level 18. Oh, okay. Well, never mind. Have a punch to the face. Birds are weak to punches to the face. Yep. Sensu. You don't like bubbles, do you? Bubble Beam. Murder. Hooray! Vatata. Uh, more punches. Bing! And done. Eevee. Oh, you still got an Eevee. Okay. Punch the Eevee in the face. Or miss. Attack fell. No! Punch it. One shot it. Bloody hell. And a critical hit. Sodo defeated Ho! Ho! Hey! Hey! Ho! Let's go! Take it easy! No. Ho! Oh, hey! He said that. Hey Ho. Hey Ho! Guess what? I went to Bill's and got him to show me his rare Pokemans. That added a lot of pages to my Pokedex. After all, Bill's well famous as a Poke maniac. He invented the Pokemans storage system on PC. 
since you're using his system. Go thanking. Well, I better get rolling. I actually aren't using his thing. I haven't used his system once yet. I have no need to. Oh, everything went green. Nugget Bridge? Oh yeah, I've got to fight like five trainers in a row. Oh, you like that? Oh! <laughs> Thanks to the easy XP, huh? Oh no, not Caterpie. Oh man! Caterpie is meant to go to Metapod and then... It's meant to evolve into Butterfree by level 10, so you're crap, mate. Unless he's doing his own challenge room. Are you doing the Caterpie only room? No, because you're using Weedle. Are you using just Weedle and Caterpie? You should have evolved as well. There's an idea for a run. If Caterpie is too hard, why not Caterpie and Weedle? And nothing else. At least you get Poison Stick. And String Sock twice. It's an idea. It's a crap idea, but it's an idea. Okay, Pidgey, 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 Pidgey. We've established birds aren't like being punched in the face. Especially with the Mega Variety. Probably take your chance with Zubat. You know what, I don't blame you. At least Zubat can do not a lot. Bubble Beam, let's mix it up a bit. Oh, I can kill you. Oh no. Neither and Freema is going to screw me up. Okay, don't worry, more bubbles. Bubbles will help. And it has. Ah, oh, safety bubbles. Could I lose? Quite easily. Quite easily, love. Okay, you. Here's number three. <laughs> At least you didn't say here's number two. I'd be terrified and get off this bridge immediately. I don't want I want no part of your smelly bridge. Okay, rat attack, go. I guess can go. Mega punch. Again. You ones must be getting tired. This is about to use not snack. Or mega punch, please. Poof. Okay, keep going. I've not even fought all the trainers off compass yet. I have skipped a few. So the fact I've managed to do two gym badges without grinding at all. Ain't bad. Oh, stomp flat. You weren't stomped, I used punch. That's a different limb. You're number four. It's not very impressive, is it? No one goes around saying, oh yeah, I'm fourth. Unless, unless there's a murderer with like four bullets, you're the four with three bullets, and you're the fourth one in line. Maybe that's the only time it's good to be fourth. That's a very elaborate scenario. Okay, well, bubbles did nothing to you. The more punch. Yep, still dead. Way. So the thing is, in this game, the elite four are much higher level than the first game. The first game they were like level 40 to like 47, 50. In this game I think they start off around level 50 and they'll be like level 65 or so. So uh, they're quite a lot harder. Especially when I've only got one mount. Oh, you're fighting type so that's a worry. Fighting type don't like getting punched though, right? Okay, that's fine. If we can just wipe out the fighting types before they even have a chance to do anything, I'll be alright. So, I, f I think of all the gym leaders, Bruno is probably going to be the one to worry about the most. You just earned a fabulous prize! A nugget. Oh no, this was the number two smelly bridge. I don't want that nugget. Oh no, wash your hands. By the way, would you like to join Team Rocket? We're a group dedicated to evil. What a sales pitch. Are you evil? We are. Join us. Why not have us? Why not have us? I'll make you an offer you can't refuse. Uh, I think we're fine. We can take your offer and put you in the face. Rocket wants to fight. 
There's a rocket in my pocket. Oh wait, no, it's a snake. Okay, I uh, punch your snake. Fist that snake. Could have phrased that better. Refused to. Way! I fisted his snake and got stronger. Just like real life. I missed? No. Oh. oh, you do learn by it. Hooray! Another rocket down. Ah, you are good. I'm alright, I guess. With your ability, you could become a top leader in Team Rocket. Well, bye. Should I call the police? Oh. I saw your feet from the grass. Uh, are you stalking me? Why are you hiding the grass across the river? Have you been using binoculars? Somebody called a police. Who's worse? The guy spying on us, or the team dedicated to pure evil? I don't know. It's both a bit wrong. More punching! Yes. Punch harder. Hooray! Well, nothing's really putting much rush of a fight at the minute, is it? <laughs> We've not even come. We've only come close to dying once, and that was with pure bad confusion. Oddish. Hold on, can Oddish show him flash and cut? Um. Maybe. Can I cut, right? Oh, wait, no, I can't go to menu, can I? Oh crap, that was a dumb idea. Never mind. Learn cut, yeah. Might catch it just for that. Or I might kill it. It's fine. I thought for a split second I could use uh, Rage to uh, knock it down and then just catch it with a Pokeball, but uh, that's not going to be an option. Um. Okay then. I can't beat your health tanks. If I hit you with anything, you're going to die. So I need incredibly good Pokeball. Oh dear. This may be an issue. I can use Great Ball, but I don't want to. Damn it. If I hit it with anything, it will kill it. So, just more Pokeballs until it gets in the ball. Get in the ball! Oh dear. Um, okay. I'll use a few more if you don't get in. Which it doesn't look like it's going to do. I'll get down to 10. And then I'll use my Great Ball. And then cry if that misses. I need cut. Alright, oh, we got it. Hooray! Add it for Oddish. Goody. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do you want to give a nickname to Oddish? Yes. This is what I do for HM saves. I just call them literally what they are. So he is just cut. See, I don't have the HM yet. See, I don't have the HM for Flash either. Oh, think about it. Oh, Venonat. Oh. I'd love me a Venonat. If only this was the bug run. Sadly, it is not. Right. Note, note, indeed. He's still alive. Well done. Oh, just go away. I've already caught one of you. I don't need you now. I want to go back to the Pokemon Center and get my PP back. And then we're going to say hi to Bill. Oh, Billy Willy. Oh, Billiam. Oh, it's all gone blue. Boop. Okay, hello. Welcome to our Pokemon Center. Here, your Pokemon's back to health. We need your Pokemon's. Um, should I take Oddish out of the party? Do I need him around bills? Ah, we'll keep him. Man, I wish I had a bike. 
Fenner is some kind of bike shop in town that didn't cost one million dollars for a bike. How does anyone afford a bike in this universe? They genuinely want to charge you one million dollars. And it's extortion of the highest degree. Ooh, stuff there. What is stuff? No, you don't want to fight. TM45? What's TM45? Yeah, contain Thunder Wave. Nah. No, thank you. I'm not good at raising Pokemon. I should release my Charmander because I haven't raised it well. You probably should take care of it. It's yours. Uh, oh, okay. Do you want to give it a nice Charmander? Uh, I don't want a Charmander. I have no use for you. We have a cut. Bum face. Take a careful bum face. Good. I will. Alright, start fighting again. <laughs> See that special attack is shit. I think you'll find his regular attack is shit. I think the only thing he's got going for him is speed. So, if you learn a physical attack, maybe you'll quit a lot. Because in Gen 1, uh, your critical is based on your speed. So the higher your speed, the higher your crit. So, uh, Bite will be good, I guess. Uh, it's probably more effective for both of you. I keep thinking Machop and thinking Rock-type, and he's clearly not. So yeah, bite and do you get wing attack in this one or is wing attack gen two? I can't remember. But bite will be one of your, like your best moves you can have, if not the best move you have. I think you're just gonna have to rely heavily on confusion, confuse and bite them. I think that's pretty much gonna be your only strategy for the entire run. And just pray to R and Jesus that uh. It'll do any good, yeah. I don't know what else you can learn that's any good. You know both physical aspects, so you, your special stat won't even come into it. What other moves can it learn? I'm, I'm, in, I'm intrigued to know. It's Super Sonic, not Confused, right? right? Alright, keep punching birds in the face. It's annoy all those ornithologists. Bill only does a cry. Way oh, hey, level 26. We've got 100 HP at level 26. Want to learn bite? Uh, yes. Bye, mage. I thought the uh, emulator stopped working then. <laughs> it just went silent for a second. I haven't saved the game. In fact, because that's put the willies at me, I should probably save the game. <laughs> There we are. <laughs> Just in case anything bad happens, like the computer decides to crash or something. Got decent TM selection. So Zuda is in numbers could work. Yeah. A team of... Well, you can't have an in-between. you just got to have like either one or just six. But six would make the grind so hard. You don't get an experience share until way into the game. In fact, to get the experience share in the first one, you have to catch 30 Pokemon. Because you get it from one of uh, Professor Oak's uh, research aids. In fact, I think for Flash I need to catch 10. And I haven't done that. I've caught 3. I'm going to need Flash. I'm going to have to catch some random Pokemons just to get that. We'll see how we go. Well, Toxic's a good move. Mega Drain's a good move. Razor Wing could work. Three. Three's an odd number. I suppose you could uh, do three and, like, 
do one that's more of a physical attacker and one more as a special attacker. And then one a half and half, maybe. How powerful is Bite? Bing. I must have misread a uh, 46 or 26. Because I don't think he learned a new one. This is it, yeah. Maybe better off with two then. Because at least with two, you can get the experience share on it. And then late game. Yeah. I don't know. SP share ain't gonna happen, yeah. Well, how are you gonna level up all three then? You just have to keep swapping them out to start with. And even then, the stats aren't great, so you might still end up getting killed. I don't know. <sighs> oh, this ain't much of a challenge at all. <laughs> bye bye. Use my shop. No. No, I will not. More bubbles. Oh, they can kill you. Oh, punching her. Okay, I want a HM save unless I do compatibility randomization. Yeah. Does about learn fly? I think he's too wee for fly. He's not pretty fly for a bat guy. I'm a cool guy! I've got a girlfriend! Well, ain't that grand. Junior trainer, who has a girlfriend, wants to fight. Oh, another rat or so. We've not seen one of those before. Thank God we've seen one of... Oh. Batman would be my starter's name. It's got to be, innit? So if you had two, you can have uh, Batman and Robin. Um, I suppose you can have Batgirl as well. Batwoman. Well, if you have six, you can have like Commissioner Gordon as a bat as well. Screw it. Let's do the whole DC universe. Oh. Oh, darn. You can have Nightwing in. Oh, I want that. Why use cut when I can just coach you out? TM19. What's TM19? I don't know what that is. Okay, seismic toss. Nah. Batman and Robin it is. There we are. So Batman will be the third one, right? I knew I had to fight you. No, you didn't. I've never been on this route. I've never seen you before in my life. What made you know you were going to have to fight me? And why am I yawning? I haven't done anything today. Okay, more punching. Punch in the face. And down you go. Name of the challenge. Uh, uh, Batman Forever. If you're using three of them, it's the third film, so it has to be Batman Forever. Or Zoo Bat Forever. Just don't put bat nipples in it, and we'll be fine. Oh god damn, leave me alone! Look at the look on... <laughs> on my face. Just the sheer blank look, as if to say, oh god, not again. This Or you could just say you've gone batty for the challenge. Zoo batty. Professor Job, here we come! Use those magic fingers to concoct an image of pure nightmare fuel. About to use PG. No. No, I won't. I'm just gonna punch you in the face again! Make a punch it more. Huzzah! Oh, critical hit for good measure. I'm yawning again. Why am I yawning? Wake up, Spanky. 
I've got a hard day of watching Loki and nothing else today. Punch it. And down. Goody goody gumdrops. I'm not so jealous. Good. Oh, hi, Bill. Hiya, I'm a Pokemans. No, I'm not. Call me Bill. I'm a true blue Pokemaniac. Hey, what's that skeptical look? I'm not joshing you. I screwed up an experiment and got combined with a Pokemans. So how about it? Help me out here. No. No, come on. You've got to help a guy out in trouble. What do you say, Chief? Fine. Go to there. I've got no choice but to help you. Oh, man. They sh they've missed a trick, because this is clearly a reference to the fly. They could have called Bill Jeff instead, as a reference. Sundar initiated a teleporter's soul separator. It's a good job I know how to use a PC. This is 1996, not every girl knew how to use a PC. Or knew how to do a complicated scientific process. It's not even got a mouse. Yeehaw, thanks bud, I owe you one. So, did you come to see my Pokemon's collection? You didn't? That's a bummer. I've got to thank you. Oh, here, maybe this will do. Way, got an SS ticket. That's, uh. Yeah. I don't want to be any part of any SS. That cruise ship, SSN, is in Vermilion City. Its passengers are all trainers. They invited me to their party, but I can't stand fancy dudes. Why don't you go instead of me? Yeah, I, I know, you, t you told me. Let me leave! Thank you. Uh, is there anything else around here? Nope. Alright, let's take the uh, easy route. Ignore the trainers. Ah, past victories. We shall ignore you all. Oh, it's gone blue again. I think something goes horribly wrong with his eyesight every time he does that. Uh, right, will you give me a Bulbasaur? I can't use it, but you're going to give me one. Hello. Take care of any Persian Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, sit back to your head. It needs a good trainer to take care of it. Okay. Well, I'm a good trainer. Peaky. Sentry doesn't go peaky. He goes, Sentry! Or something to that effect. Right then. I haven't got cut yet. These bikes are cool, but they're way expensive. Hello. Hi, welcome to our bike shop. Have we got just a bike for you? There's a million bucks. How are you still in business? Are you... Right, what well, you got? Eight bikes? You think you're going to make eight million dollars? By the end of today's training. And you can't even put a shopping basket on it. Well, that's a final insult, isn't it? Oh, hi. I want that. Electrode ignored orders. Good. Electrode Swift. No, that's wrong. Training Pokemon is difficult. Your Pokemon's obedience depends on your abilities as a trainer. I know. Why are you telling me this two gym badges in? That's fruitless information we should already know. To move that I fell asleep, <laughs> perhaps true again. Ah, oh, Squiffy on your sleeps. Well, if you missed it, we just met up with Bill. We got the second gym badge on the first attempt, absolutely wiped the floor. We haven't even come close to uh, having any trouble yet. Ooh, dig, I want dig. Give me dig. Those miserable rockets, look what they did here. They sold a TM for teaching Pokemon how to dig holes. Those cretinous villains. That cost me a bundle, it did. Well, don't worry. We'll get it back for you. And then we'll keep it for ourselves. Hey, stay out. It's not your yard. I'm an innocent bystander. Don't you believe me? My TMs bring all the boys to the yards. And damn right. We're going to dig. <laughs> I just woke up before we even... This is true. Yeah, did you just like, sleep for like seven hours during the day? I mean, I'm not mad. I'm, I'm impressed. I'm just impressed you can sleep that much. And I'm totally not jealous. Also, I didn't go back to the Pokemon Center. 
Kevin can smell your kilt. <laughs> uh, that's a bit. Ooh, drowsy. Ooh, drowsy might be uh interesting. What if I punch it in the face? Oh. Punch it in the face? Trick is to be unconscious. Damn! I knew there was something wrong. Way! Defeated rocket. Give me a tear. Return a tear, Mr. Poke your mom. You mean poke your mom? Hey, Shadow Beam. How you doing? Alright, let's give the TM back. Or we could just use it ourselves. Use Dig. Good job, man. I use Dig. Oh, Bumface can use Dig. Screw it. Okay, Bumface is a use. How's it going? We are smashing through this game. Don't want to go left or down. No, I need to go down, don't I? Can I get three gym badges in one session? There's a daycare. I can leave Pokemon there, but it's useless to me. Bum, ba -da -da -dang. Bang, 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 bang. Yeah, I'm good, thank you. I'm glad you're well. I believe there's some hidden items down here. Let's see if we can find them. Give me. Give me. Give. No, oh, okay. Never mind then. I haven't been in the city yet. Oh no, I've got to do SSM before I do the in city, haven't I? Alright, let's avoid all of these. You know what? Screw you. I can do SSM. I can do SSM without Granny. I've never seen a year around. Are you good? It's a bit of a personal question, isn't it? I'm betting you, mate. What you got? Oh, a Butterfree. <gasps> You've got past Kevin. It's Kevin from the first game, everyone. And by the first game, I mean the second game. What would be funny if you make a Robin and Doe duo? Yeah? Throw a Mr. Mime in. You can have the Joker in as well. Way hey, Level 28. Sondar, defeated book catcher. Again. You are too good. Hooray. Good, good, good. I'm going to fight both of you. I do. Oh, no. Me? Well, okay, I'll play. I do not wish to play. Kanga Kevin wishes only for murder. Let's tear you asunder with my arms. Or failing up my bubbles. Punch it. Bye bye. Oh dear. Okay. And another Pidgey. Will I change? No, no, I won't. Damn it. If I thought Charmander could use Dig, I would have uh, called it Dig rather than Bumface, but here we are. Is that a name rater in this game? Or is that then just Gen 2? What, so you're thinking uh, Pidgey and. So Pidgey is Zubat? I just had a thought. If one of those trainers uh, uses Whirlwind, it would force my HM saves into battle. I'd have to swap them out, but it would technically affect the fight. So would that be a loss? I, I can't do anything about it. Would I have to reset? Hmm. Do that in Pidgey, Batman and Robin, yeah? Would Spearow be better? I'm gonna run out of moves, bye. Okay. Way! And another one down. I didn't start it. Yes, you did! You came over. Look, mate. Look, mate, you came over here. You clearly came over to me. And that's for a fight. I dare you tell me that you didn't start it. You had the gold to tell me that. You full of shite. Spear actually has better stats than you think. Yeah, I've seen it done before. It can learn Drill Peck, and by the time you get that, that's basically the win button. 
Right, let's deposit uh, these guys. Because I'm never going to use them. Cut, get in the bin. Deposit, bum face, get in the bin. Okay. Now I just back to Genghis, Kevin. Alright, we've got to do the SSN. Hi, Officer Jenny. Hey, you're not in the normal wings. I just caught a squirrel that was always getting into mischief. I think it needs a good trainer to set it straight. Good. Well, I want nothing to do with it. Do the SSN. Whee! Good news, guys. I got a cup of tea. I have a ticket. I got a golden ticket. Welcome to the SSN. Oh, it's not quite the same, is it? Hello. Alright, so we're going to go through the cabins and we're going to fight them one by one. <laughs> Very fancy. Alright, I'm coming up to. I'm nearly up to my time. Okay, I want to try. I don't know if I'm going to do it. I want to try and do the SSM before I call it a day. And then we can kickstart tomorrow for the gym battle. So, uh, not tomorrow. No, Friday. I don't stream first two Thursdays. Because I need some time off streaming. Even though I'm doing it in the evening. I don't even get a day off, guys. That's how that's how nice I like to uh, treat you guys. Especially to those that are subbed. You get your money's worth. Oh uh, we didn't kill we didn't kill him with one bubble beam. That's interesting. And alarming. Hello again. You pup, how dare you barge in? Who are you calling a pup? That's just weird, mate. Gentlemen don't go around calling people pups. That's just odd. Okay. Yeah, we're going to have a rival fight in the SSN, so we'll do that. We'll cap off with the uh, rival fight. We have everything he's been on free. Free spanky is best spanky. Because I'm as free as a spanky. If you give me your prime soul. I promise I'll never do that again. Come on. Hello. Give me items. Wait, I'd like a cherry pie, please. Oh, bye. <laughs> You'll never get that cherry pie. Well, so how do these people feel about you just barging into their cabins? Oh, it's Chagger Wiggly Tough. Good for you. Ooh, there's an item there. I want that item. I love Pokemon, do you? Yeah, it's alright, I guess. I won't be playing games back to back if it didn't. Youngster wants to fight. Sent out Nidos. Kanga Kevin. Murder. Poof. <laughs> it's never wanted. Oh, you love Pokemon that great, that much, you've only got one of them. Ooh, it's here, mate. It's here, mate. So yeah, it's worth going around all these cabins because once you do SSN, you cannot return. What's that? Body slam. Yes, please. Trying to learn body slam. Kevin can't have on four moves. Delete an older move to make room for body slam. Body slam might be uh, one of our final moves. So place comic punch. Comic punch and Kevin and body slam. I'm not sure what the uh, damage on body slam is. But Genghis Khan's uh, physical attack is better than his special attack, by like triple. And it can learn Slam. Uh, it can possibly paralyze as well. So judging by the fact he's only got 15 rather than 20, I'm going to guess it's stronger than Mega Punch. So I think Mega Punch is done and void now. And I believe it's more accurate. It's probably still have 100% accuracy. I don't know, because the game doesn't tell you. 
So I had to buy a strategy guide when it came out. I don't know if the manual... Does the original Pokemon manuals tell you all the moves and what they do? Because the, how the hell are you meant to know what all the moves do? On the trail of Team Rocket. They're outside, mate. Go outside. What are you on here for? Oh. Why are you here? Hmm. There's any trash? I don't think there's much in here. Oh, I found a Great Ball. I think that's all there is in here. I'll have a quick, I'll have a quick loop, but I don't think there's much. You're just proving that we're on a boat. Yeah, I think Body Sum's gonna be a good one. Although I don't know whether to swap it out for um. Hmm. Yes, but Earthquake though. Hmm. Oh, you've seen a Snorlax. That's nice. See ya. Yeah, obviously we'll, we can't worry about anything involving Switch, because I can't Switch. Check out what I fished up. I don't want to know, mate. Can I just point out that in none of these houses, or in these cabins, we haven't seen a single toilet or bathroom. But where does one go to use PP pee -pee for water gun? Is this just the win button now? So yeah, uh, Mega Punch is null and void now. I'll just body slam everything, I guess, until we win. I'm all out. Whatever, mate. So, so if we didn't, I couldn't be asked to explore SSM, we would have missed Body Slam forever. Unless Genghis Khan naturally learns it later, but I'm not sure. Okay. And crush it with your own weight. When you think about it, how different is Body Slam to just tackle? It's pretty much the same move, right? Charging at it, and then charging at it with your belly, I suppose, is the only difference. Dragon Knight, no doubt, are the only real threats. For some reason, Tangler. Well, they can poison me, and it's pure grass type. I can cut down and smudge the bushes, I know. Oh yes, I see some Pokemon ferry people across the water. How fascinating. You must be a hoot at parties. Ooh. Oh, I've come to my two hours. But yeah, but let's beat the rival at least. Let's beat the rival for today. I think that's a good day of cutting off point for the day. More Growlis. Right, can I kill you with one bubble beam now? I didn't do it last time. Kanga Kevin, bubble it. Yeah, that's better. The last one took two hits. But again, my Kanga's guns special ain't that great. Bubbles. Bye bye. What's for? Can I charm and learn strength as well? We're not going to need it for ages, but pretty sure we can. You never saw me at the party. You were never meant to see me at the party. Last one's the fight. Good. Oh, Jigglypuff. Jigglypuff, you must die. Take this. Pop that balloon. Hurrah! Take it easy. Never. Well, I mean, if I beat a rival today, not only we'd have done two gym leaders in one session, and we'd have beat our rival four times in a single stream. Got anything? I hear many people get seasick. You really are a fountain of knowledge, aren't you? Yeah, no, I never would have thought. Oh, hi, rival. Bonjour, Sondar. Imagine seeing you here. Sondar, are you really invited? So how's your Pokedex coming? I already caught 40 kinds, pal. Yeah, but you're not doing a challenge, are you? 
Crawl around in grassy areas. It sounds like an insult. You look like you crawl around in grassy areas. Alright, go can go Kevin. Kill it. Uh body slammer bitch. Now what you got? Ratata. Body sa Oh, quick attack. You cheeky sausage. And down you go. Can go Kevin. Send shrew. Uh bubble beam actually. Change it up, mix it up a bit. Put a bit of variety in. Well hey. And who you got? Eevee again. Uh body slam it. Poof. Good. And another level. Hooray! That's kind of trying to learn tail whip. No. No, I don't think so. He finally gets around to learning a move and I tell him no. Yes, you're raising your Pokemon. Well, at least he didn't say pro. There was a Cutmaster on board, but it was just a seasick old man. But good itself is really powerful and useful. Yes, there's no way us as humans can get round a small tree. Now for a questionable part of the game. Ugh, I feel hideous. Oh, seasick. Sondor rubbed the captain's back. I feel sorry for Mini Kevin in the pouch. It went into brain damage for all those bodies. Yeah? Yeah, it does say uh, Kangaskhan wants to protect its young. I fail to see how by forcing itself into every single fight going. Well, now that I'm not sick anymore, I guess it's time. Yo, shunt of lots. Ew. Slots the captain's puke. Okay. Chim 1, boot it up, cuts. Oh, I don't have my uh, HM stays with me. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, I didn't go to the bow of the ship, so I sh Or the deck, even. I don't know if there's anything on the deck worth having. Oh, I won't be able to come here again. Oh, hi. Ahoy there! Are you seasick? Tell the book, he's, he's stolen your sign in. What do you think it is? A wolf? A bear? <gasps> Wombles, I'm out! Well, if Ash was actually a Pokemon, oh no, it's too hot to get in philosophical debates like that. <laughs> what if Ash's mum is a Pokemon? And he is just a baby. Uh, body slap. I haven't used that move in a while. And he's dead. I apologise for clipping the mic with my foot once more. Uh, I'm running out of body slams. Uh, mega punch it. Oh, you missed. Oh, great. I got hit with acid. You done free damage to me, you bastard. Murder. Hooray! Well. So, uh, this boat's just full of sailors and hoes, right? Oh, uh, I feel ill. Stepped out to get some air. So nothing on here. Let's do a little jig. Hello, sailor. Do I have to do a little jig with a sailor? He's sailor the sailor man. He has a, not got a Genghis Khan. I good at this rhyme. The end. Ooh, see. Seamen and the hose and sailors, yeah. And a ten year old who's right in the thick of it. Just don't think about it. Don't think about it. Sundar defeated another sailor. Hooray! Let's get off this goddamn boat. There's nothing here, is there? I've got body slam. That's the only thing I could. Actually, he is. You kicked his ass, my trademark phase is avenged. That's okay, though. We taught him a thing or two. And all we had to do was press our body against them until they got increasingly uncomfortable. And it won. It got us the win. God, I wish I could move a bit faster. 
Reminds me of the song by Captain Dan and the Scurvy Crew. I... I'd be lying if I knew what that was. <sighs> Cat and Dan rings a bell, but I just can't picture it. Two, two. I think you meant to say Newt Newt boat. There goes the boat. The boat nooting off over the horizon. Okay, let's get to the Poker Center and let's teach Cut. Where is the Poker Center? Where is it? Where are we going? We pretty well have for one episode. We beat the rival for four times. We got two gym badges. We got a little HM slaves. Sorry, my rat's got me away. That's okay. I'm about to wrap it up anyway, uh, Shadow. Because I think uh, starting a stream with a gym leader will be a very good place to start for a Friday stream. I'm not going to do any grinding. Heal your Pokemon back. Yeah, heal, heal, heal. Uh, is there anyone worth raiding? Let's have a look. Bugger all again! There's never anyone on the afternoons. Nobody's dumb enough to stream in the afternoon, UK time, like I am. It seems. Uh, right. Uh, HM1. Boot up HM. Contain cut. Teach cut to a Pokemon. Well, you can both learn it. Why do I have you? I'll teach it to Bumfacer. Bumfacer's got dig as well. Uh, ground. Anyone in the No, nothing. Ah, uh, back from the park drinking and smoking, and just as I'm about to finish. Do you like to save the game? I would like to save the game. Oh man. Right, I'm gonna go and watch Loki with the folks. Oh, we should save the game. I haven't got a save game yet. There we are. Good man. Okay. That was fun. That was fun, guys. Uh, let's wait that off. And. Ooh, giant spanky. White lightning on the swings. That sounds fun, mate. You should have stayed. So I got the end again. That's fine. Face! Up oh, with my uh, Betty Boop cup. Like the manly man I am. <laughs> Cop mic. Yeah, uh, that was fun, guys. I really, really enjoyed that. Uh, I can't wait to get stuck in again on... <laughs> I nearly read that as Awesome Cup and Awesome Skirt. I've got, sh I've got shorts on. It's close enough. Uh, yeah, cool. <laughs> uh, yeah, that was going to do me for one afternoon. It's, it's sweltering here once again. So I'm going to bugger off. So let's have an ending screen. Boop. There we go. Oh, yeah. He might be in the skirt, yeah. <laughs> nice relaxing that you've had. Well, I'm glad I could help with that. Hmm. Right then, I shall see you all later. Again, there's no stream of Chaotic tonight because uh, she's busy. So why not watch, watch uh, Crazy Pants plays instead? Because he's streaming. Say hi to him. And yeah, I shall see you tomorrow night at 9 o'clock with the Evil Within. And if not then, uh, Friday for more. Kangaskhan body slams everything. The game of the film of the movie of the game. See you later. Take care. Bye. Also listen to my podcast. Bye bye.